Hey all the crafty people. I hope everybody's doing great today. I am psyched. We are going to uh, put all of our goodies that we have made or that I had in my stash into the books. So then we can see where we're where we're sitting, okay? We're not going to worry about the tags or anything like that. We're just going to put the actual uh, bits and pieces. So we had the corners, and I know I've got another one in here somewhere. We had our file folders that we made. We have our belly bands. There's my other corner. We have our pockets our belly bands, and then I did have these out of my stash. Each each one is getting one of these, so we can place this one as well. Okay, so we're going to get just jump right into this. I want to make sure that you can see everything. Um, I don't think I can keep all of my stuff uh, where you can see it, but let's see. I've got my belly bands. I've got my my big stuff, my two pockets, uh, regular pockets, and then my two file folders. Okay, so I think this is fine. And I don't want to mess up any of my uh, any of my stamping. I let's see. Do we like this here? Or Huh. Could I put that right there? That would That would be pretty nice, wouldn't it? Well, let's leave that there for a moment in case I find someplace else. That is going to be, well, you just can't help it. If you're going to make bulky things, you just, you just can't help. But, let's see. I want to see how far in... I think I had decided that, because I, I played around with this earlier a little bit, I cheated, uh, that I liked on this page, I was pretty much going to put both belly bands. It just seemed like both of them worked so well. It Some of that pink is really a little too bright for all of the other pink that's in here. So I'm thinking that these are going to work very nicely there. So now let's see. And of course this is a pocket here. So now I have one file folder which we'll, we'll see about where we want to put that. And then I have my two large pockets and I have my corners. Where did I put my corners? Ah, down here. Got my corners still to do, and we have this. But I'm going to have a pocket here, and this one's going to be a free-floating pocket, so I am going to put a backing on it, all right? So um, that, that we will get to. Um, okay, so we have this pocket here. I'm not too sure if that's just too much right there. I don't know. Let's see. What about on the inside of this? I know there's stamping there, but how does that look? Eh. I, I'm not I'm not sold with that either. However, this would probably be absolutely gorgeous there. Well, this is just so wild. What about this one? No. I don't like either of those. Okay, can we do a little tuck spot? How about just one of these? 
just a little tuck spot there and then we can play around with a few things that might go into those tuck spots but I still have my my inking if you know if I'm not gonna go crazy I don't know I could just do that If I do this, it just cuts. It just cuts right into my, but that's okay. Okay, let's just do this one. And I think I'm going to use my fabri -Tac. Just for some reason, I think it's going to work nicer. I think this is actually the, uh, like when you get a hot dog. The, the food wrapper that's wrapped around the hot dog. I think that's what these are. Lord, I haven't had a hot dog in decades. Not years. Decades. I, um, I'm allergic to a lot of things. But beef is one thing that I, that I can't seem to, um, you know, to take on anymore. It just, it doesn't like me. Which is a very sad thing, but you know the funniest thing is, is mostly I miss being able to eat hot dogs. Now I know there's turkey dogs and chicken dogs, and but if you are a true lover of hot dogs, those just ain't going to get it. No, just ain't going to get it. No. <laughs> I'm sorry, they just are not going to get it. So uh, I just did the three sides. So I actually have two pockets. I have the one behind and then the actual pocket that the envelope makes. All right, so I have two pockets there. So there's that. I hope you were kind of following why I was blabbing. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, so let's move on. Got a pocket there. And then this is a pocket. And then this is the belly band. Now, that's pretty right there. Um, this is just such a strange kind of strange color for. Yeah, let's go with this. Let's go with this here. So, I need to... I'm going to put this on the end of the page. So, this on the end of the page. And then I'm just going to kind of make a mark where I need to score this. And let's see. This is where this line that you put in your scoreboard comes in handy because I'm going to line this mark up with the line that has the score the uh, black ink in the groove and then I'm going to look I'm just going to tuck this under and see how straight because here's my line and I'm just a little off so I'm going to move this down just a smidge and I'm going to go ahead and do a score line in there. So I moved it over just a smidge and we're going to fold this up. Because remember, we knew these are too long for our page. Alright. So I am going to now glue. Do I want to go ahead and do that? Yes, I, I am going to go ahead and do that. I want to go ahead and glue this edge here, which is the outside edge, and then the bottom to the score line. I'm not going to um, do anything beyond the score line, and I'm not going to go up the other side. So now let's just find the corner, run it up, 
and along the edge of the corner. Let's make sure that you're not gluing to any other page. Okay, and we can move on and that's going to give that time to dry. Okay, so then we have our belly band. I'm just uh, trying to find where I want to put this one. Now that I like it here, I do like it. I do like it here. And I got a lot of browns. And I've got some of this peachy stuff. Yeah, okay. So we're going to set that there. And then here's our center. So beautiful. And this will get stitched down. And now we have our two corners left. Two corners left. We have this. Actually, we have three corners left. So I haven't done anything with the corners. Um, and then we've got these two to go. We've already stuck our belly band on the back side of this. So... That's awfully close, and I don't know that I want that there. Um, how about here? No, it kind of gets lost in that. I, I want it to really nicely show up. Okay, so there's that. I do have some of the the uh, bluish teal color. I don't know. This page is very boring, though. Very boring. <laughs> so that would work. Okay. So I like that there. And then we've got this other pocket. And there is our other belly band. And here is the end of our, which we'll probably, we'll try and do something um, kind of cool and fun with that. Flip. This is a pocket. Flip. Now what do we think about this here? How's that? I like that one. Let's keep going and see what else we've got. This is a, another little flip out. Now, see, I can't really do it there. I could do it here. Okay, I really do like it there. I, I'm, I think I'll be happy with that one. And... Then we'll just figure out the corners a little later. So I'm going to open this up a little bit. I'm going to line this up with my page. And do the same thing. Just make a little mark where I know I'm going to want to run my... line and this time it runs right along where it needs to be. There we go. I'm just going to fold that. Okay. I know that's just a little funky instead of cutting it off, but you know, there you can do so much with just a little piece. Uh, I think, though, I am going to cut off 
if I can get my fingers under here, I am going to cut off this little piece. Let me just see if I can rip it off. There's that. There. Okay. Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and do this one. So we're going to put the outside piece and down to the score mark. And I'm not going to glue what goes on this side because I want it to flap. I want it to flap. <laughs> All right. Come on, there we go. And a little glue down there. A little glue to the score. Boop. Line her up. There we go. Once you think it's kind of caught, then just make sure you're lifting up your paper that you're not gluing your other stuff down. I love how we start getting all these little pieces that are hanging over the edge and just keeps getting more interesting and more interesting. Love it! <laughs> okay, so we have got that one figured out. Let's see, so we have our little pocket here, which actually we made two pockets out of. We've got a little flap here from a pocket. This I have to finish off, so it'll be a floating pocket, so to speak. Pocket. Pocket. Let's go ahead and get our belly band attached. Now you can take a piece uh, like a, an inch thick and fold it in half, glue it onto here, and then glue. Which, you know what, I think I, think I will go ahead and do that. Um, let me just get... this piece. I'm going to cut. Let's see. Yeah, I'm just going to cut it in half. Okay, so there's that. Kind of, sort of, almost an inch. And then just kind of uh, find a mark that you're happy with and fold it. Okay, let's just cut what we need. Okay, glue down one end. This way you'll be able to use the entire belly band. So we're going to glue one end down on the very bottom of the belly band. And one end at the very top. Okay, let that catch hold, and I did go back on all of my belly bands and add those uh, pearls to the flowers, and let's go ahead and put this 
Oh, down. Let's see. It's not quite as tall, so I'm just kind of centering it as my page is. And there we go. We'll let that set. Flip, 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 flip. Here we go. I'm going to put this one in. Remember to close the bottom. <laughs> Got to actually have a pocket. This one's not going to be a belly band. Okay. And this one I'm going to not put right on the outer edge because I do have this material uh, bias tape. So I kind of want that to show. There we go. Okay. And this one. I hope everybody is looking at my giveaway and doing the little bits and pieces you've got to do for that. It is going to be such a nice giveaway and you will win one of these. Um, one of these is going into my Etsy shop and then the other one is going to be one of the giveaway prizes. And I have multiple giveaway prizes and they are fantastic. I had some great Etsy vendors giving me some great, oh, whew, some great stuff. And um, one gal, uh, Cheryl, her store has not opened yet, so she just sent me some things that she has, um, oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful work. So, um, I will let you know when her Etsy shop opens up, but um, for now, you'll just, uh, she's got a YouTube channel, so you'll just kind of visit that. Okay, so there's that one. But yeah, I, I, um, I wouldn't mind keeping one of these myself. <laughs> but, no, not going to happen. Okay, so let's do this again. There we go. Fold. Let's get two of these so that we can... Put it up. Do, 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 do. And then I got two more for something else. Somewhere. Somewhere I'll need them. And we are at, oh goodness, I can't tell. 24 minutes? I can't tell if it's 24 or 34. I'll have to stand up. So I've been trying to make my videos a little less. A uh, little, little less in length. Um, I find it extremely difficult to these days. I used to be able to sit and watch, usually at bedtime, but I would sit and watch an hour long. But I've got back into reading my book, books. You know, I I don't own just one. <laughs> I read my book now and then. <laughs> 
Oh gosh. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, I go through Kindle and and uh, or Amazon Prime. We have so. Uh, yeah, I go through. I go through and get my books from there. So that's kind of nice. I don't have room for books. I have enough. <laughs> I have enough books to put on my Etsy shop and stuff like that, and to use for uh, altered books and things like that. I, I you know, and. And I don't want to read any of them that I have. <laughs> it's like weird. That's just weird. Okay, get that down, back down in there. And then I think we are done because I think I, I the only thing left is the pocket. Okay, let's. Put this here. Just want to make sure I've got them in straight. And I want to slide this over just a little bit. There we go. I figured I could move this one up just a little bit because this hangs. So it might look like it actually is going to cover the entire page. When it doesn't, really. So nice. I just love this. Love this. And this is a little out of my comfort zone, guys, because it, it, it's shabby chic-ish. Ish, ish. And uh, that's, you know, that's just not usually where I go. But I do have, you know, I do have, like, lots of bright, bold colors as well. That's why I put shabby chic-ish. Ish. I don't know. Um, okay. Yeah, and then we've got this pockets already down in there. So that is one. Okay. Guys and dolls, the only thing I didn't do were my little corners, and we'll get to that. That won't be a problem. So it's going to be a nice beefy one. Nice beefy one. Um, I do need to really start thinking about how I'm going to, because this is not my cover, uh, how I'm going to cover this. I have big envelopes I could use. Um, I have chipboard I could use. I don't know yet. I will have to think on that and get back with you. So, you guys saw me do one. I'm going to do the other and then I'll do a flip through and show you that. And let me just remind you what I have for that one. I have these two. I have these two. And remember, this is a belly band on a belly band. So those are my two belly bands. And then I have these two pockets. And I have corner pieces for, for this as well. This is the corner piece I have, and then my two book corner pieces. All right. I don't want to get these mixed up. No. Okay, guys. So that is going to be for this one. So I, when I finish this one, I'll come back and do a little quick flip through. And then when we're done with that, I don't know where we're going yet. So maybe when I do the quick flip through on this video with this, uh, in a minute for you. Um, I'll tell you where we're going next. Or it might just be a surprise. <laughs> Love you guys. I'll talk to you all later. Bye. All right. I just wanted to go through the uh, second book. So that you could see where I put everything. So on the first page. I went ahead and put this beautiful pocket down. And then we've got our pocket here. I haven't uh, closed it up yet. Just in case I want to do something off the end that's a little more interesting. And uh, then I've got a pocket just with some material um, lace here. This is going to be... Uh, this one is going to be put down. I'm not going to have this one as a floating pocket because I did do the stamping so that I could do this. Uh... And then we have 
Um, oh, I didn't actually put this one down. So, you will get to see a little bit on this and a little excitement. Woo! I'm gluing. How exciting. <laughs> okay, and I want the card to match up. There we go, and then this piece will go underneath there. Now the other pocket like this, I cut. Um, I didn't put it where it was going to uh, go underneath. don't quite remember why, but I think it just felt right at the moment. Okay, and then here is a belly band, and I also did... Uh, where I made myself little hinges at the top and the bottom. This is really starting to come together now. Now that we're putting our goodies in here, there's my center. And then I have this pocket here. And I put this little corner tuck in there and then this is the one I went ahead and cut off the uh, brown pages are a little shorter than some of the other ones and it was going to cut off way too much so I cut some of this side off and then some of this side so I could get the whole picture in there and um, you know it just didn't it just didn't leave enough uh, this will be a standalone pocket, uh, so that still has to have the sides folded, and, and uh, so that stuff will have to be done. And there is the little tab from the one that we just put down. And then this one I left, I just did two sides, so it's a tuck plus a pocket. So that's my little um, my little uh, gift from Leslie paper pizzazz um, and then you've got my other belly band here little flappy thing so we are looking pretty darn good pretty darn good in that pocket there still not glued down and bam so now we have all our bigger elements in. So I still don't know what I'm going to do. So it'll just be a surprise when I come back. <laughs> uh, we might work on the cover and try and, and, and uh, you know, get this thing under control. Because right now they are kind of flappy. They're, they're big. Yeah. It's a big one. It's a big one. Um, and I know we still have to work on these big tags and, and they have to, they are just copy paper, so they have to be made a little bit more substantial and we have to work on our other tags that we have put in here. So we still got some stuff to do and I still have paper clips and another set of keys to do, smaller keys. And I've got globe pins, charms, that kind of stuff. So we still have a lot to do. But not it's not going to take us a lot of time. We're getting close. Getting close. So look over at my giveaway because one of these bad boys is going to be in the giveaway. And um, the other one's going in my shop. I thank you guys for watching. And we will talk to you guys later. Like I said, big surprise. Don't know what's next. <laughs> Bye.